So over here in OneDrive, if I want to upload a file, I can go around and click on upload and select files. So once I do that, if I were to go around and select out this document and click on open, then what happens is that it uploads out that particular file right here. As you can see, it says uploading one item and there is this uploaded file right here. So if I were to go around and upload out the same file over here, so if I were to go to files and select out the same document, let's say I made some changes to that, uh, that particular document and I want to upload it, then I can click on open right here. And what happens is that it detects that the file already exists because of the same file name that exists right here. So if I were to go around and click on replace, then what happens is that it uploads out the file right here. As you can see, it's uploading out that item and then it replaces uh, that particular file right here, just like this. And um, uh, on top of that, versions of different files will be created as well. And that is something that we're going to discuss in upcoming videos. So now uh, if I want to, let's say, for example, have the same file name, but I want to uh, keep them separate. Then what I can do is I can go to upload, select files or folders or select out this file right here and click on open. And instead of selecting replace, you can uh, click on keep both. So once you do that, what happens is that the file will be uploaded right here. And then over here, what happens is that you can see that one, the number one is added around onto the end, denoting that this is another version of this file right here. So that is how you can go around and replace out or keep duplicate files inside of Microsoft OneDrive. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.